The boat trailer is connected to the vehicle's rear use of towing hook. The trailer is placed in the water, and that boat is allowed to float freely on the water. The boat trailer features a quick-release locking system or hook lock. It has a hook that can be engaged or disengaged on the boat's hook lock using a crank handle. The trailer needs to be pushed into the water, so using corrosion resistant materials is important. This trailer is made of aluminum and features a torsion axle made of galvanized steel with a shelf of solving rubber car. The trailer frame, including the axle mount, is also made of aluminum. Aluminum is a sturdy, corrosion resistant material that is lightweight. The frame consists of two main beams running from front to back. Once the positioning is precisely determined using tech Another mechanic uses hydraulic tools to create bolt holes on the main beams. A brass brake is used to bend the main beams to a specified angle. Aluminum can be bent without compromising its strength. Next, a layer of anti corona paint is applied to the axle mounting plate. Technicians place the main beams onto the axle mounting plate, aligning them with magic bolt holes. This kills the main beams onto the mounting plate and then fastens the real cross beam below the two main beams using bolts. This reinforces the size of the frame, providing stability and support for the bolt's weight. A cap of brackets is bolted onto both the real cross beam and the two axles. This brackets hold the supporting frame, which is inserted into the gaps of the brackets. The top of the supporting frame has a layer of copper to protect the boat's hull. To reinforce the supporting frame, holes are built into aluminum plates, which are then bent into anti-rocking braces using a press brake. These anti-rocking braces are bolted onto the brackets to provide additional support. The company holds a pattern for a rotating supporting frame that can be adjusted to different angles based on the installation axle holes. At the front of the frame, mechanics install the tow bar, which connects the two main beams with the front cross frame. A towing rope is connected to the vehicle's rear towing hook. Four trailers with winches. Aluminum parts are cut and used to create the winch frame. Technicians place the parts onto an assembly fixture to ensure proper alignment and weld them together using an electric welding gun. After welding, and the brake other wells is cleaned using a cleaning agent. Next, the winch frame is bolted onto the tow bar, and the winches connecting brake lines are installed. Cables to connect LEDs on the trailer are also attached. The getting frame is also installed to ensure the boat remains centered on the trailer. Aluminum mudguards are installed above each tire and reinforced with brackets. They are bolted onto the frame. 